Hi, my name is Kelly Turpin, and I am the pharmacist in charge here at Wholesome Co. Today, we're going to talk about cannabis ratios. A ratio can be defined as a numerical way to express the relationship between two or more things. When it comes to cannabis ratios, we are generally referring to the relationship between two or more cannabinoids, the most common of which are THC and CBD. But you will also encounter ratios of CBG, CBN, and other lesser known cannabinoids. Ratio products provide a broader spectrum of effects than products that just contain THC. This is theorized by the entourage effect, which proposes that different compounds in the cannabis plant work together to provide unique benefits. An example of this is the combination of CBD and THC. When CBD is added to THC, especially in an equal or greater amount, it is thought that the CBD will lower the psychoactivity of THC while increasing the anti-inflammatory effects, which is thought to be beneficial for pain. The most common ratioed products you'll encounter in Utah are one-to-one -one products with an equal amount of both THC and CBD. One-to-one -one products are generally recommended for patients with persistent pain, those who have a history of anxiety, or patients who have nausea. You might encounter one-to-one-to-one -to -one -to -one products, which have equal amounts of THC, CBD, and CBG. These products are recommended for pain, mood, and for those who have stomach conditions such as Crohn's disease or ulcerative colitis. In addition, you may see one-to-one-to-one -to -one -to -one products with CBN instead of CBG and still equal amounts of THC and CBD. These products are best used at night to help patients who have insomnia in addition to a qualifying medical condition. Finally, you may encounter one to 10 ratios in which there is one part THC to 10 parts CBD. Sometimes these products will also have CBG or CBN added to them in an equal amount to the THC. These products are best recommended for patients with epilepsy, patients with autism, or for those patients who do not want to experience the euphoric psychoactive effects commonly associated with THC.